and welcome back to another um, special video um, this is about um, the eclipse on July the 27th okay alrighty um, now uh, if you guys realize for all my subscribers and all um, newcomers um, please remember to like and subscribe this video okay on July the 27th of the year 2018 that we're working in whether or not you're still working in the year 2017 of you already pass which your birthday has been because this video is being um, done on the 22nd which is a, um, a day of duality okay it is um, the beginning the ending of the last week that we have done okay um, it is very important for um, each and every person to um, receive the information of this video because it is going to affect each and every person this eclipse that is about to begin on the 27th of July that is going to take place um, the ending of this week you need to be aware and aligned with this eclipse okay so um, it's going to take place I think Friday is the 27th so um, let me just look to let you be aware because some of you have already start to feel the energies of this eclipse okay yeah it's Friday the 27th so thanks to my angels and guide okay um, alrighty um, um, this um, eclipse is going to release deception okay so brace yourself people because there is a lot of information that is going to be coming out normally the beginning of each year I will give information about what to expect in the year the year 2018 I did not um, give that information because that information would only um, instinct fear in you guys okay and what I try to do and what my guides work with me to do is to release fear okay whenever we um, give certain certain people are not uh, advanced enough to accept some of the information that needs to come out and this is it before I used to write a blog but what I realized is that people was using the information on the blog so what I do was to write my first book and uh, um, and give the information in that book so if you um, if you are ready for the information because even in my readings I will give information some people are not ready for it some people are not aligned the energy is um, your energy vibration you're not aligned for it because some people can't take the truth and then other people will say because I remember a elderly lady she says listen um, you're very gifted but you don't want to tell the truth um, not tell the truth um, she makes it a different way she says you don't want to tell exactly what is happening now not all the time that the angels and guides are going to channel the information that is supposed to come out and if it's channel I have to make it that's why when debt comes up I have to make it I can say expect this but I don't want to say to you hey that is going to come up so be aware because some people are not aligned with the energies now I'm a multi-dimensional beam and that means that I'm a star seed that came in with a lot of wisdom and information for people okay and this is why you have to understand that my readings are um, different in the aspect of uh, um, I, everything is to me in challenge I, I, I don't write down things I don't um, uh, write down things uh, meditate some people meditate and then write down things I don't I don't do that as I give the um, information the information is channel through my vessel to come out and sometimes I'm not saying the word properly or I switch to another language it's because of whoever is bringing forward the information um, is either from and um, most of the time is from um, um, a different dimension or the, the, the situation um, is as, as if they can't connect with the language okay so um, this is what happened but from the 7th of July until 
um, the ending of September some people give a date for September um, they're saying there is no dates as to the ending of September whatever lies whatever deception that people have been doing whatever secrets whatever people have done and kind of um, like the Dutch would say you 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 fake it under the tapai okay so whatever you have done whatever that you are being very deceptive about it's going to be coming out okay so brace yourself whatever secrets uh, it's going to be coming out there is a lot of aggression there's a lot of aggression that is happening since July 17 if you look at uh, um, the aggression between people it is becoming more frequent and uh, um, more visible okay so what is happening and if I'm looking there is the information that is being channeled is as if I get information in um, um, uh, codes and numbers and then you have to decipher it your brain basically <laughs> decipher the information okay so if I'm looking that way if there's no one there's nothing it's just a clear space where it's as if you see the numbers and the information coming in and because I basically work with numbers um, that's how they deliver um, code sequence information okay and some people will realize that sometimes they sit down and they see in front of their eyes just codes of number sequences uh, formulas are coming down and some people were not aware of what was that but um, whatever you're working with Archangel Metatron Archangel Metatron is the person that delivered these information in secrets and code and they're saying not only Archangel Metatron but they're saying Lord Kutumia and um, Lord Kutima, um, they work in that sort of a way because they're from a totally different other dimension. Okay, we have different dimension, we have different solar system, and this is what happened: is that the universal beings and uh, um, the, the 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 brotherhood, the twelve brotherhood, the white brotherhood. This is a um, group of collection consciousness that comes together that was placed um, to protect this universal um, this universal and um, because there are many many different types of universe okay we are not the only universe okay we are not the only um, universal planet what I need to let me um, say that I should give to you is that Mars um, um, the first inhabitants in this solar system was on Mars and uh, because of uh, an explosion that happens on Mars uh, they had to transport um, civilization and make this new planet Earth and everything actually came from Mars so um, uh, be not alarmed about this information because it was information that was out um, light workers um, um, people like myself that has um, inf universal information the Indians uh, um, the American Indians they all know this and and that sort of a thing and this is why they live from the land and this is why they live off the land because the American Indians were the first civilization that has done um, ascension okay ascension is what we're working towards um, ascension is uh, um, the consciousness of who we are we are going back uh, from the materialistic three dimension to the fourth dimension to the fifth dimension and to the sixth dimension the only person on this planet that is working in a sixth dimension are the Buddhas and the monks okay the Buddhas and the monks and remember I'm not saying the priests or um, um, the Vatican City and that sort of a thing no the Buddhas and the monks are the only person on this planet that is carrying a six dimensional frequency there are other people who are at the five the fifth dimensional frequency and 
they are consciousness awakened people um, they are people that um, some of them are in India some of them they don't eat they drink water um, they basically survive I don't know if you have ever been to India um, you can see these people on the street um, you can uh, they can you can give them food and they will help you um, uh, and show you uh, your life the existence of the astrologue was actually born from out the Indians okay because if you notice they have their different gods um, they have Buddhism and they have other religion um, they and the Indians the American Indians are the only one that understand that milk something like milk is not to be drink um, if you realize that even Asiatic people they don't drink milk or eat cheese and that sort of a thing because it is uh, has to do with their DNA structure okay so if you are an Indian or an Asiatic person it's always uh, you tend to um, and if they drink milk it's rice milk okay rice milk because that is from the herd that is from that was um, from the herd. Now the milk from the cows have and carry different DNA structure as humans, and that is uh, the reason why. Okay. Um, there are a lot of people um, moving from out the fourth dimension to the fifth dimension. Okay, um, and these people are really conscious. They eat only plants. Um, vegetables um, some of them have gone raw vegan um, and uh, nuts so it's uh, vegetables and nuts if you realize the changing on this planet is that people are moving to alternative help they are moving and they're changing their eating patterns and um, people are becoming more consciousness and awaken and um, the, the the movement of this planet is that uh, um, mother hurt is as if she's been rebirth and I, I, have, I have to keep on letting people understand what is uh, the changes and what is happening it's as if mother earth is being rebirth okay so what she wants is to bring back the love and peace on this planet now there have been different um, um, UFOs people call them UFOs but they're not really UFOs yeah unidentified objects on a, on a Unidentified beings, but there are just different species. It says we are a species. Now, all of us came on this planet uh, to go through this ascension process. Okay, um, you're going to be re realizing that a lot of people are leaving this planet, so a lot of people are choosing, and sometimes is their time is up, and they're choosing to move um, away and cross over to the spirit world. Now. A lot of you especially the light workers people and um, most of you have become light workers because either a parents has died or tw two parents have died and you um, because of the crossing over of the, um, these people who were on this planet that was what the contract was that they would have left to work um, in the spirit world to help you to reveal the illusion so people you will realize that people like uh, myself um, it's always that either one or two parents uh, or um, or your twin um, some of you could be born with a twin and uh, this twin or this person has moved away a lot of people who have uh, um, dealt with situations uh, when their parents was alive that they didn't resolve these situations secrets information is going to be coming out okay you're going to be pushed to find a way to resolve the situation a lot of people since end of June going coming in the month of July a lot of people have been uh, confronted with family situation with um, secrets family secrets family situations that are coming out things about people that are coming out what you're going to see is that in organization government institutes the an organization is that they are going to start changing up certain situations they're going to start changing up um, and, and and the changes that you're about to make is going to be good because these changes is that they're realizing that if they don't change up certain aspect they are working against the energy of the hurt 
a lot of people are not aware that most um, um, most um, um, company most um, uh, government institutes an organization or most governments are aware that they had to make these changes because a meeting was taken a meeting had taken place with all the leaders of the world and this has to do with um, spirit beings who came in to connect with them there was a huge meeting that took place a couple of years ago and um, they understand that um, we as a species on this planet need to change the energy vibration whatever happens on this planet affect the whole universe that this planet is in now 2018 um, it is 2 plus uh, um, 1 is 3 plus 8 is 11 what is the number 11 it's an awakening a lot of people begin to see 11 whether it's 11 11 um, 11 11 minutes past 11 or whether it's 1 11 11 but a lot of people and and this is uh, um, what is happening once you start seeing this number of 11 whether 11 11 or whether 1 11 or whether 9 11 or whether um, whatever 11 that you're seeing whatever num number sequence that come before or behind 11 it is awakening you it is letting you know that you are going to be um, um, the next group that is going to help this planet to evaluate okay so that means um, some of you are going to realize that you want to change your career some of you are going to decide to go vegan some of you are going to decide to move towards more conscious um, way of living I'm seeing a lot of people um, a lot of my friends or people are connected in Europe um, there's someone who I know very well he went back to one of the islands um, and um, I've, um, I've saw a picture of him uh, uh, in the week and he has lost like 20 um, kilos 20 pounds um, which is the less I think it's like 25 pounds and all he did was to start meditate and eating healthier and this is what is going to be happening to a lot of people on this planet for the people who start seeing 11 11 that means that you are going to play a significant role in the process of this new evolution that is about to, um, to affect this planet because the year 2018 is going to bring the consciousness of humanity from out of the third dimension into the fourth dimension so by the time we reach 2020 most of us is going to be vibrating in the fourth dimension what is the fourth dimension now the fourth dimension is when we are capable of understanding that we need to balance spirituality and the materialistic world and spirituality okay because we were all born in the third dimension and the third dimension is the the dimension of uh, materialistic so you were born and you know that survival is the key and how to survive you have to do anything to survive but now you're going to be moving from now until 2020 you're going to be realizing secrets lies are not going to be a part of society anymore because all of these whatever deception whatever secrets whatever you have done against another person it's going to come out okay and it's only the bad things that is going to be coming out because if you have been um, positive honest to people try to help people and that sort of a thing it's going to evolute is going to be coming back tenfolds at you because you have been vibrating on a positive energy vibration and that is what going to come back tenfold to you but the people who have been um, um, I'm, I'm dealing and 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 disrupting the energy vibration of love because everything is all about love time doesn't exist nothing on exists except from what we're seeing on the, the in this planet 
we're living on our organism planet if the planet dies we all die because we can't survive without the four element that each and every person is placed under okay we're all born under a specific sign and that specific sign has four elements and this is what I'm saying to a lot of people is that I'm um, I've explained to a lot of people that you need to find out what is in your birth chart you need to find out what planet govern you you need to find out all the planets that is in your birth chart what is about to take place from now until September is that the deception, the secrets, the lies, the people who have been um, um, decepts, uh, given and doing negative things, you're going to be finding out that you're going to be um, the grip that you have, whether you were using it in and a deceptive way and if you were lying to someone who has been um, you know if uh, let's say you're in a relationship or you have friendships with people and you have been lying to yourself but lying to your partner and lying to other people this is going to be coming out okay it is just um, you know like out of the blues someone is going to say oh is that your wife or is that your partner you know I have seen them with so 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 or you know that sort of a thing so whatever the situation is that is going to be happening and I'm standing doing this video because um, um, from the beginning of the month I got the changes that I had to make changes they wanted me to work with the animal spirit guides they wanted me to work um, with laying down the cards not showing my face but now I'm just laying down the cards so people awareness could be awakened and they wanted me to change the whole system and go only on camera when I'm doing specific readings or like with the monthly readings and that sort of a thing because they wanted you all to be awakened and to be ready for what is coming it is a time when healing healing a lot of healing uh, modalable a lot of healing methods are going to be coming out okay and a lot of people on this planet, um, people like myself, have been moving because all of us, all of us that are light workers or people who do readings or um, um, quantum healing and that sort of a thing, um, is you're seeing that we are all changing something about us or something about the situation. Now, a lot of people who does the same thing that I do they tend to be dressing up doing these sort of things and um, candle work and that sort of a things and you know I don't do that because I um, my guides and angels said I just have to be myself and um, it doesn't really matter I don't have to tie my head I don't have to use a stick I don't have to use a candle I don't have to do anything because um, I'm just who I am I just want people to see me as who I am I just have the information to um, give to you so I don't want people to judge you know because there's a lot of judging a lot of people have been uh, misjudging people and a lot of people have been dishonestly um, trying to bring others down and a lot of people have been doing things and it's like it's coming out okay because every seven years there are changes on um, your body how you look but there's changes with your DNA there's changes with your cell um, there's changes you will realize that every seven years people move there's a transition of people and this is because seven nine and 12 or significant um, um, years and if you look at your birth chart and you get a birth chart reading people will tell you that over seven years or over three years three years seven years nine years and 12 years or when significant things will take place in your life okay so as we look at the situation and what is about to transpire because a lot of you have been feeling since the month of July just weird energy you just have been feeling just strange you just do not understand some people are emotional some people are full with hunger some people are aggressive and um, in the past week because I was um, you know preparing my monthly 
readings and there was something that was happening and was very aggressive and I said oh yeah I have to do a video on this because people need to understand that a lot of people aggression and this aggression and hunger that is going to be coming up that means there's a lot of emotional um, pain that is coming to the surface of each and every person and this is why you're feeling this aggression this angry this jealousy this hate that is coming up and you need to release this and if you don't every um, release and find a way to heal yourself you are just going to push yourself to the edge and you know it it is either choose to be or choose not to be you know it's it's choose to be or choose not to be and what I mean with that is that whenever these emotional because it's all emotional pain it's all emotional pain because things are going to come up from your childhood things are going to come up from the exes things are come going to come up from your parents things are come up from um, you know how you try to get something to be done and this thing wasn't done and that sort of a thing so um, what is going to be happening is that all these situations is going to start coming back and they're going to come full pleasure out to you and you are going to expect that other people are supposed to be um, helping you to remove them but people can advise you you know so some of you are going to be receiving readings from some people and the readings is just going to be a wise and you're going to be thinking this person can't do their job no the person is doing their job but your angel and guides and whoever they're connected with is showing you your shadow side so it's as if it's a period where everyone shadow side is going to come out my shadow side is going to come out everyone shadow side is going to come out so whatever we have stuffed down whatever we didn't want to um, um, look at for years um, things that we were lying to ourselves about uh, things that you have been lying to others about things that you have done that has cost someone else their lives or push someone else um, to another place it's all gonna come out it's all gonna come out and it, it's, it's gonna come out and it's either you're gonna say yes I did do it or you know I'm sorry that I did it and that sort of a thing but it's going to be that you because it's your karma it's your karma and it's your shadow self coming out to meet up with what you have not been dealing with it's as if some of you are have been married for years and you're going to decide one day um, you know I'm letting this go I'm letting this go because it's not really doing me any good um, what is this marriage is really and and this sort of a thing and then you're going to find out that oh my god your husband or partner have a total different life somewhere else and was leading a double life and that sort of a thing because um and especially the air sign people this is going to affect the air sign people the hurt people because the hurt people carries the energy vibration so the aquarians gemini and libra and remember this full moon is the Aquarian full moon. Who are the Aquarians? The, the Aquarians have the energy of the star, hopes, wishes, and dreams, but yet still they also have the energy of the fool. They're going on a new journey. So a lot of new starts is going to be happening. You know, a lot of new starts are going to be happening. A lot of, um, um, you know, wishing and hoping is going to be happening. Um, and, and, and this is going to affect a lot of uh, um, the earth people the Taurus Virgo and Capricorns and why is this going to have affect you guys is because you're vibrating with the energy vibration of the hurt and because you're vibrating with the energy vibration of the hurt you're going to be feeling all of these situation coming at you and all of these people coming at you okay the most people that was born on this planet is the fire people and the water people okay um, the most the population of this planet is built up with the fire people and the water people the less people that was born under the sign of uh, 
the air sign okay and 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 the earth sign okay and and <laughs> and this is it um, this is it and I'm, I'm, I'm smiling because um, there it is showing you that the people who are going to affect as I said it is the Aquarian the Gemini's and the Libra's the Taurus the Virgos and the Capricorn they are the ones who are going to be feeling um, the changes because it's as if other people have done them injustice and it's like karma coming back around now for the Aquarians you guys sit tall you guys sit because you are the one that is bringing people from out the three dimension towards the fourth dimension so a lot of you Aquarians are going to be um, um, dealing with a lot of people with karmatic situation helping them to move forward helping them it's as if you're going to be shaking them up so the 27th is um, the energy of the Aquarian and it's for a degree so look um, go and try and find a birth chart and uh, and look for a degree where is Aquarian in your birth chart and that is where it's going to affect you whatever else Aquarian is in your birth chart four degrees of the Aquarian in your birth chart that is where the energy is going to affect you in that house because each and every one of us in a birth chart has 12 house and in the 12 house wherever the Aquarians four degree of that 12 house that is what is going to affect you okay um this most of the people that is going to be affected um by um this because it's as if the hurt sign and the air sign is going to be helping you guys to make these changes so you are going to be co connected with a lot of hurt sign okay and air sign people because um the the air sign people who are going to be coming out good is the Gemini's the Liberans the Gemini's and the Liberans are going to be coming out good because that is their sister sign the Aquarius is their sister sign so for the Gemini and Liberans wherever that Aquarius is in your birth chart you're going to be coming out good with this because the Gemini's are always trying to to bring balance but if you as a Gemini have been lying and using a misusing your energy or misusing your power you're going to be feeling it in a harsh way so you liberals have to be aware of this okay now as we look at the Capricorns you guys are going to your spirituality is going to raise to a higher form so some of you um, Capricorns and Taurus Taurus and Capricorn people is going to have feeling this shift and it's going to be a shift of conscious so if you're a Taurus and a Capricorn you're going to be feeling this um, feelings of consciousness and it depends if you're working on your positive energy or you're working on the negative side of your um, of your, your 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 sign as a Capricorn or as a Taurus this is going to shift you in the direction so if you're working on the negative side a lot of things are going to be removed out of your life and it's as if your whole career your whole life is going to um, crash so that new possibilities and new things can um, you can rebuild okay so whenever and people always said oh my god I got everything and then all of a sudden now I, because the spirit guides your angels whoever um, the, the beams that um, protects you they realize that uh, you know it's time for you to make a change and whether or not you want to make the change this is how people remove things out of your life what is going to be happening also is that if you are working in an organization that is not vibrating in a positive energy or you are not vibrating in a positive energy you are going to realize that you're you're going to be removed out of that organization okay or you're going to remove out of that group of people and you have to make a career change and you have to realize what you have been doing for the last 10 20 years you need to change this and move in a positive direction okay and um, if you are seeing 11 11 you are going to be effect uh, effect is going to be coming up between the, um, 
and now um, until the end of the year your whole life is going to be changing career wise uh, um, and then break up and that sort of a thing what I should say to a lot of you is that some of you that have been open and wishing for something and it's not coming to you no matter how you manifest this thing and it's not coming up to you that means there are some um, um, situation that you need to heal there's some karmatic situation that you need to heal and if you don't heal this karmatic situation it's you're not going to be um, moving forward okay whatever the karmatic situation whatever the situation that you have been um, dealing with um, it can be from childhood it can be from family it can be you not loving yourself they want you and they're going to push you because once you're seeing 11 11 this means that you see 11 11 is telling you that there is about to be a conscious shift you are going to be having a conscious shift your angels and guys are showing you the 11 11 and especially if you are working on a number 11 life part if you're working on a number 11 life part your spirit guides are basically saying to you listen whether or not you want to make this change this change is going to be coming out and you have to accept this whatever is coming at you whatever transition that is coming in your life you have to accept this transition because it's time for you to make this change um a lot of people are going to realize that they're changing career okay or a lot of people are going to be decided to release themselves from a relationship a lot of people are going to have a lot of hunger a lot of hunger and you need to understand that um, sometimes it's best to walk away walking in nature is going to be helping a lot of you to deal with the anger that you're dealing with inside because there there the anger that is coming up is the hanger of how something has transpired in your life the, the now is the best time because it's the time of eclipse if you have been going through pain anger um of whatever the situation is in your life now is the time between now and um september end of september 30th of september write this thing down let it out write it down let it out let um people know um, you know you're sorry you don't have to and if you can't write you can always record it and you're gonna end it by saying um, you know I forgive you and I'm asking for forgiveness and I'm releasing this okay so whatever the situation is whatever you have done whatever you have done um, in the past or with someone or that have affects someone um, you need to let it go you need to release this you need to release this pain a whole lot of people walks around with anger anger because of something and it's always coming from childhood that the anger of most people is always coming from childhood it is um, things that you have brought in from past life which you need to work out with parents situations work school that sort of a situation the hunger that you have within you it's coming from a past life and it's coming from childhood and you're gonna be um, facing is as if your shadow side is going to awaken you and said listen it is time for you to heal the situation it's time for you to see the shadow of who you are and especially people that carries the energy vibration of jealousy this is going to be coming at you whoosh over you because um, they need to replace jealousy with love they need to replace the jealousy with unconditional love and they're going to awaken you and, and said hey why are you jealous what is the reason why are you jealous um what is the reason what has affect you why are you so jealous why um, would you be jealous over someone or something else why don't you want someone to um, you know go forward in their life or what it is you or whenever you block someone else or whatever you lie to someone else 
whatever you treat someone else in a disrespectful way it comes back to you because it's karma because since um, the 21st of December 2012 karmatic situation is bouncing back like a boomerang as you do something that is deceitful against someone else it comes right back to you and some people can be feeling it and I think most of the light work people they are feeling this some may not be feeling this as yet but expect that all the deceitfulness all the jealousy all the people that have done other people injustice um, and you thought that it was a secret it's gonna come out and this is what is going to be happening between now and September there's a lot of eclipses with this Aquarius there's a there is two um, eclipses and um, two um, um, you know a full moon that I am really really um, like whoa I need to step back it is the um, Aries full moon and the Aquarians full moon I'm really so it says wow okay back up that is the time that I take my energy back because of you can just you know th these are the times when people go crazy people go crazy because um, especially people who have done other people um, injustice and that sort of a thing they go crazy because it's understand. it's it's constantly going on them you know so what would you need to know and, and that was Google oh, and, and these are the strange things that happen because all of a sudden it start talking without anyone talking to it so these are the strange things that is going to be happening so whatever is um, affecting you and whatever is coming up at the sir whatever is making you so um, upset whatever the shadow side of you whatever is not working out for you you need to let it go it is a period of letting go eclipses eclipse certain things out of your life and you need to let it go another thing that we're trying uh, that they're saying is that the people who are carrying um, either you're working with 11 11 life part 11 life part or you you were seeing the 11 11 a lot of uh, endings are going to be coming in your life a lot of endings are going to be coming in your life and some of you are seeking um inner wisdom and guidance and you will you know is, is, is a thing that they're, they're saying whenever you're ready whenever you honestly honestly um to god is ready to understand certain situation the master will come okay some of you are going to be pushed to drugs and rock and roll at this time because you don't want to face your fears you do not want to face your shadow side you are so ashamed of what your shadow side is and you're not facing that shadow side and a lot of this is going to be coming up this is going to affect a lot of people on this planet it's going to affect myself it's going to affect my child is going to affect people in my family and that sort of a thing okay so it's not going to be something that is happening to some people it's going to affect every child on this planet you're going to see that the new babies that are born um, some of them will have um, pain in the ears or pain in the knees or um, pain in the kill some of them are going to be crying more in this period because it's as if they're cleansing and some people if you realize that you can't deal with um, the, the the sound of a baby if you um, realize that you can't deal with the sound of a baby that means whatever is, you have been hurting from you are not ready to release it because the sounds and this is what people do not understand sounds is very important especially the sound of a baby because this is a new spirit that is coming in and if you realize that your baby just constantly constantly crying and you can't do anything because um, you can't take the crying it is because you yourself need to release some emotional situation that you have been dealing with okay um
simplicity they are saying simplicity simplicity they are saying they want people to start being simplicity so um you know you can always do you know it's not like oh you have to sell your house and that sort of but no it is just simply if you used to drink a glass of wine then you drink water sparkling water instead um if you drink um as you go out to drink and to make yourself feel better you're going to say no I take a cola because um, it's as if when you say look whatever my shadow side is I want to release this I want to heal this I want to come in you're gonna call up basically call this up in your spirit guides and you're gonna start looking because a lot of people have been looking on YouTube to find some readers will connect with you some readers won't connect with you and that sort of a thing so you're gonna find this but you know if someone doesn't connect with you whatever situation if you are going to a counselor and you realize that after six weeks you don't feel any difference you you have you can't find what it is you're looking for it's you know you're not getting the light bulb moment well oh my god so that is the reason why I was so because you know then you're realizing that something um, you need to find someone else or some other modal that is going to help you I hope because um, it's going to be a chaotic time that is about to come in because of people um, are, are going to be feeling the energies especially um, two days before the 27th and two days after the 27th and from the 27th of July until the 30th of September this is going to be alarming you're going to see people people are going to just uh, start spitting out things and saying things and you need to know you need to stand back and said you know that's your opinion okay um, you're going through this process where you need to release the shadow side so okay let me not take this personally okay and that's how you're going to deal with it now I want to say thank you for um, thank you to each and every person and um, if you would like to do a reading to find out what is going to be happening in the spirit for you you can always um, connect with me via the website go via the website because uh, um, sometimes you, people call to clarity and that is just for 15 minutes or a short question a short answer to a question um, this is going to be something that I have to go in depth with you it's very good to send a, a photograph a photograph and your um, date of birth is very important just the photograph and your date of birth is very important and then we will go from there um, it is better to order a, a 60 minute reading which is um, sixty dollars because there is so many information sometimes I go over the hour because of the information that needs to come out and how I need to guide you as to how to deal with a situation I want to say again to each and every person thank you thank you so much for being here thank you for supporting my channel and um, I'm, I'm uh, you know basically as I said um, the channel is going to be um, changed up I'm going to start doing the zodiac apart um, so look out for that uh, and look out for the monthly readings namaste until next time